All parties in the matter of Wells versus Blount. Step forward. 19-year-old Jasmine Wells is suing her former friend, 19-year-old Kayleen Blount, for a refund for items to be used in a photo shoot, lost wages, and travel expenses. Miss Blount, you do hair, is that right? Do I do hair? Yes. No, I don't do hair. I what sell do you, hair. What do you do with hair? I sell it in bundles, and that's it. I don't do hair. You were doing a photo shoot. What kind of photo shoot were you doing? A photo shoot to advertise my hair. And how do you do that? I just post a Facebook, like on Facebook, and What I do you do with the photo shoot? Have somebody take photos of the girls wearing the hair so that I can use it for advertisement. So in the photo shoot, you have girls mm -hmm. using your hair product. Yes, ma'am. That somebody fixes for them? Yeah. And you it's have an artist there doing it? Correct. And you sell the hair to the person who's used as the model? They get a discount on the hair to... I don't care if they get a discount. Okay. The question is, they don't get the hair for nothing. They pay you for it. That's correct. Okay. So the plaintiff paid you for hair that you were supposed to have somebody arrange as part of a photo shoot that you were doing. And the plaintiff had done this once before for you. Is that yes. right? Yes, yes. And you sold her the hair for this second photo shoot when? This was back in December. I can't imagine. And how much did you sell her the hair for? She paid 165 And when was the photo shoot supposed to be? I don't remember the exact date, but I just know it took place in no, December. No, well, get, you're in a business. Correct. Remember the date. What, you sold it to her in December. When was the photo shoot supposed to be? I don't remember the exact date, but I know When it was, was the photo shoot supposed to be? December 2nd, and it was rescheduled for December the 9th. Did you go there on the 2nd? Yes, ma'am, I did. Did you go there on the 9th? Yes, ma'am, I did. And on what date had you bought the hair? November the 28th was when the hair was, the hair money was due. First shoot was scheduled for 12-2. Right, and I canceled it? Show me. Um... Let me see. Show me where you canceled. Show me where you notified her the date and time because what she's suing for is the hair that she paid $165 to, which you didn't return to her, and for her travel expenses for two trips that she made, 130 miles, to do the photo shoots. So I want to see the cancellation notices that you sent to her on either December 1st. I don't have that information, but. It was in the group chat, and she knew. No, no, so. no, don't, don't, you can't tell me what she knew. Okay. You have to show me how you notified her not to be there. Okay. And you don't have it. That's correct. And where's her hair? Her hair is with a person that she had make a wig for her, and... No, no, no. Good. She hired somebody and gave them the hair to make a wig for her? She, in the photo shoot, there was a person doing the sew-ins and the makeup, and once the photo shoot was canceled, that was no longer on the table. So that person that made that was doing the sewings is the person who made the wig for her. The person that was doing the sewing is hired by whom? Was hired uh, by... By you. The person that was sewing the hair into whatever it was was not hired by her, yes. was hired by you for these photo shoots. For a sewing, not for a wig. 165, you owe her for the hair. Now, how did you get to this first photo shoot? I drove. You have receipts for the gas? No, ma'am, I do not. How are you supposed to have me figure that out? I, well, I do have documents pretty much stating how far it is for me to travel to and from Savannah to Augusta, Georgia. And I also have on here what the average fuel cost is, which is $9.37. And then... Um, $9.37 the, a what? For gas, for me to get from Savannah to Augusta. It's $10? Yes, ma'am. So that's $40 for two round trips? Yes, ma'am. That sounds very reasonable. $205. We're done. Judgment for the plaintiff. Thank you.